All right. So looking at this in your question, um, I personally probably would not have. It's a tricky thing. I I would probably have a smaller version of the shot and have your text. You know, imagine this is all black here. Then you got the text underneath. And you know, sometimes on reels you have a certain area below, and then you know people write down, "I did only this person," or just background stuff, or whatever. And then I think you could have subtitles there. Um, I think it's a tricky thing because I you usually don't see it, even if you have a foreign reel. Um, I just would not have it over your animation, and the, the, the problem is, I immediately, I think people will go to the text, you know. That's usually the the problem with subtitles that people go and and they kind of miss what's going on, and the thing is you could have it without the subtitles, and then at the end of the reel you can say by the way here's the shot with subtitles if you want to know what they're saying. For me it doesn't matter because I understand it. This is all German. I know the actor that says it and everything, so it doesn't really matter to me. But as a whole, I might probably take it off and then at the end have it, and even then have it below the animation. Muss aber was vorstellen, sonst kann ich mich in der Schule nicht konzentrieren. Now, given what she's saying and how she's saying it was really weird. Like there, there are two things. The animation is great, and you know that's the things that are kind of weird from a technical point of view are it's a tricky little list. So the hands are still super IK. There's so much going on, and you know make sure that there's really it's not so stuck. His reaction to the head here is very separate to what's going on to his body, even on something like this. Like she has a lot of movement. With all of this going on, you would have a slight change in the in the upper body and the elbows, um, you know, coming in and the shoulder moving around. Um, even on that change here, this would go a bit lower. Just, there's a bit more weight involved. Also, as she's changing, you know, it's just kind of a rotation in the leg, but it would still be a slight uh, change in his wrist and fingers. I do like what's happening there in his face, but you know, again, she comes down uh, to IK where like, the wrist is kind of stuck. Like his hand um, stays put through here, like the finger poses. Like this, if your kid is doing this, you would also re re grab and grab her here and readjust the grip to go holy shit I'm not gonna want her to fall down actually I would probably take my arm and go around her waist and this you know and even if you're holding here and you can't hold here she's gonna fall down so as a parent <laughs> I would say that hand will go up here to really stabilize and even on animation wise, I wouldn't be too bad because it's a bit more contrasty and you change the pose. And then I'm curious, once he gets there and she goes over, like I'm not, I'm not sure why he lets go. Like I know she does this, but the thing is, if if he's okay with her strangling him. And being like this, like why, con why be concerned about holding her at all if she seems, if he seems okay for her to be like this and, and hold on to it? You know what I mean? Like it seems like, oh, I'm confident that despite you strangling me, it'll be fine. You can just monkey around and you won't fall down. Yet here he holds on to it. I don't know. Something slightly weird. I think I would. If you're doing this, then I would have an expression with him where like his. Head goes up and he has a slight like oh, whoops like I'm ha I have no air. And then when she does this, you know, you might argue, okay, well now she's letting go of the grip a bit. Her legs are a bit more relaxed, and because she's holding on it with her arms, that's when he lets go and then can grab onto that. That's just from a, a technical thing here. Your arm here is super straight. There's no arc and kind of stops on the linear key. Boom! Like hits this wall. Um, and then when she gets off here, same thing. Like she pushes off. There's nothing going on in his shoulders and everything. Yeah. Again, IK arms. It's just. How is your life and stuff? Now, all that set aside, when you listen to her audio. Muss aber was vorstellen, sonst kann ich mich in der Schule nicht konzentrieren. How she says that, like that's someone that 
<clears throat> either standing or sitting, and it's kind of really demure. It's, like, it's kind of like that small, like, oh, but, but you know, if I don't have breakfast, I can concentrate. N now, with that quiet voice, and there's some crazy finger stuff going on here. Am I doing a and can this make a streak? I don't know, that feels more like her, her hands are. Can this make a are melting at this point. I'm not quite sure if that's the right thing because it's such a moment there. That's a bit weird. I'm understanding going for streaks here, but can this make it natural? That's a bit weird. But my main problem is that this whole action of her going over there and all that stuff, none of that fits the audio. You know? It's just she really sounds like she's just sitting or standing there not moving whatsoever. And having this massive action here. And especially during this, like, whoa, like, you know, this change through here. This is it's a common problem in feature animation where the voices don't quite match what the action's doing, but at this point, this is like times a thousand. So that's my biggest problem. Like, as always, your animation is great. It's just, this comes now to, well, your voice does not match the action at all. Like, you're you're just taking this and you just want to animate it like this, but you're not really paying attention to the audio. It's kind of a problem. And that's kind of like a cute, like, oh yes, but then that's more like, holy shit! So, for that on her, it will be a bigger smile. Like, that's how the audio comes across. How she says it. Coco Pops. Yeah. Have you ever lied star? Muss aber was vorstellen, sonst kann ich mich in der Schule nicht konzentrieren. Magst du Schoko? And then when she says konzentrieren, is her. This needs to be more like that at the end. Konzentrieren. Konzentrieren. N, it's an N. I N. Konzentrieren. So uh, out, maybe some teeth. Max to Choco Pops. Max to Choco. And then here, that's actually an M. So maybe you can roll in the lips a bit more. It just feels like he has his mouth closed and opens it. Max to Choco Pops. Just a little yeah. bit. Max to Choco Pops. Yeah. Have you ever lied on a star? Yeah. Have you ever lied on a star? The da is, is, that works really well. Have you ever lied on a star? Have you ever lied on a star? Leider, leider, here. Have you ever on a I wish I could scrub in quick time, but when it says leider, lai, ai, I'll bring out the the corners more. Where is it? Yeah. Have you ever on a You know, doing this section. We have a leider, just pushing that a bit more. Yeah. And then. Max to Choco Pops. Have you ever lied star? Hmm. And it's it's weird. It's something that's really weird is that like Max to Choco Puffs, like do you do you like the Cocoa Puffs? Just yes. And then he goes, Well I don't have any but like he is showing it to her. So are you saying it's just weird because the way he says it. So Choco Pops. Yeah. Have you ever lied on a star? Have, have ich aber leider nicht da means I don't have any here. You know, and it's just weird for him to show it because now A, you're saying you just really mean and he teases her that, well, it just doesn't work, it doesn't work with the audio when he says, well, I don't have any here, like, but you just showed them to her. So you're saying you're just going to it's just kind of that to be mean to her. I'm not quite, again, it's this weird combination of I'm not quite getting what you're doing with the animation compared to what the audio is. Anyway, I don't know. It seems like I have more questions and I might need some more uh, answers from you and then we can go from there. All right, thanks. All right, there's an email. You can sign up. You can start whenever you want. You can submit whenever you want. You get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right, thank you.